Security plays a big part of what we do. A meter is installed or a sensor is installed or a pump is installed somewhere out in the field. It's transmitting that data and it's a location out there potentially at a customer's home. And so we're very sensitive to the fact that we are dealing with data from devices that exist out in the field that could be uh, interpreted in some uh, governance rules as customer data. Utilities are increasingly looking to leverage cloud and cloud services to better support their business operations, um, to better connect and enable their customers, but also to take advantage of some of the security and resilience benefits. AWS supports sensitive security requirements across the globe for critical infrastructure customers as well as public sector or government entities. In terms of uh, security, uh, we have to, uh, to put in place different uh, features thanks to uh, the cloud and AWS especially. The first one is the traceability of the use of the data across the group. Each owner of data must be sure that the data is uh, used correctly by others. The second one is the ability to put some anonymization in uh, correlation with the GDPR. With AWS security, you're going to see the similar security um, measures that you would have in a data center, such as physical server security, physical security control, server isolation, isolation of the network, and isolation of storage. Instead of having to maintain your own infrastructure or your data center, you can apply those resources internally to more innovation and then you can get as needed services such as compute power, database, and storage on an as needed basis. Regardless of the amount of investment that you have in AWS, you're able to inherit the security controls that we've put in place for security of the cloud infrastructure. And these are controls that we've put in place to meet the needs of some of our most security risk sensitive customers. Because their customers are potentially logging into and viewing data that we're presenting on behalf of the utility. We have to adhere to not only the audit requirements and the governance rules uh, that we enforce upon ourselves, or maybe that are industry requirements, but that whatever the customer in their locale are required to comply with as well. AWS makes that a lot easier uh, in that we don't have to uh, worry about whether or not the underlying infrastructure is GDR compliant, or GDPR compliant, or CCPA compliant. That as long as we've added that layer on top of that uh, for ourselves, for that customer in the locale that we're in, uh, that we can check the box on that pretty easily. Um, and we're in a position to, to meet customers and utility end customers' requirements a lot faster than we were if we had to do it individually for every single one.